Hi guys, I'm finally back again. Sorry I've not been on for a while, but uh, I've not been doing so well on Slimming World, so I need to get back on track. I've been bad, and uh, so it's time to get back on plan. So I thought I'd do a nice easy recipe. As it's coming on to autumn now, I've got my slow cooker back out, and I'm going to show you how to do a simple, really simple bolognese that the nice thing about this one is you can put it in and basically leave it leave it going so if you don't like you're standing around waiting for your food to cook this is great because you just bung it in the slow cooker and literally leave it on for about six to eight hours and it just does itself basically um, and then come tea time all you need to do is just cook, cook your dried pasta so I'll just go through the ingredients um, a little bowl of mushrooms some cherry tomatoes. I've got three peppers, but any variety. I've got two red and a yellow. Um, some extra lean mints. Um, a tub of passata. Three tins of tomatoes, chopped tomatoes. Um, and I've I've just got for some extra flavouring two slices of smoked bacon that I'm just going to chop really fine. Um, two onions. And then I'm being a bit lazy, so I've got some chopped lazy garlic and for some extra flavouring I've got some balsamic vinegar and again any variety of balsamic will be fine um, and some low salt and some black, coarse black pepper and finally a little bit of Worcester sauce. And basically the plan is chop everything up put it all in and leave it. It's as simple as that, but um, I'll chop these up and show you them in the slow cooker shortly. Okay. Right then guys, I'm back. Everything's chopped and in the slow cooker. And that didn't take long at all, about 15 minutes just to chop everything up. If that, um, one thing I did forget to mention, an essential ingredient, was I have added some mixed herbs. Um, obviously if you've got Italian herbs that goes better, but um, I just had the plain mixed herbs, so. Um, I think the Italian ones have slightly more oregano and uh, basil in, but and they are slightly nicer if I'm not honest. But I've run out of those, so and I'm just giving this a good mix, so we can get all our tomato juice all the way round. Try and zoom out so I can show you. Um, and as ever, it's quite difficult to do this with one hand, but I'll, I'll, I'm just trying to show you. Um, it is slightly easier when you're doing it yourself and you're not trying to film at the same time. <laughs> Give this a good mix round because you want all those flavours to spread throughout the whole dish. Um, there's literally no sins in this. Um, the only possible sins is when you have your, obviously when you serve it with your pasta you might want some cheese on the top. Um, so you could go for... Um, you know, just uh, some half fat cheese just to save your allowance. Or you might go for some dried parmesan because there's less, less fat in parmesan, so you'll add a bit more of that. Or obviously your allowance of normal cheese. Or if you're super good, <laughs> no cheese at all, but uh, I do like it with a bit of cheese on salt. <laughs> and I've already put my salt and pepper in. Now, although there doesn't look a load of sauce with it at the minute, um, as the veg cook, um, all the sauce, the all the juice from the veg will sit in it, and it will expand. So don't worry if it doesn't look too saucy yet, because once it's cooked, it will be. Believe me, because the lid goes on this, no steam escapes, or like you would with a saucepan. So on goes the lid. We've got it on on the high setting for the slow cooker, um, and it's already getting warm now. And I'll literally leave that and. It's now um, half past twelve, and I'm going to leave that until about seven o'clock tonight when I have tea. Um, so I'll see you later, and I'll I'll um, do a film of it on the on the dish when it's ready. All right. Hopefully, it won't be so long till my next video. But see you next time, guys. Bye. Hi, guys. And here is my finished bolognese in the slow cooker, and there it's served on the plate. And I'm just going to, I've weighed out um, 54 grams of half fat cheese, which is my healthy A. So I'm just going to put that on, like so. Not 
job. I'll just just tidy that up. <laughs> right. And there we have a lovely bolognese, so easy to make and totally sin free. Okay, I'm going to go and enjoy this. See you next time. Bye bye for now.